Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum, dear viewers. Good morning and warmly welcome you on HM Tech Solutions uh, official YouTube channel. Today, I show you how to repair this uh, Fujika walkthrough metal detector gate main unit and model is FJ18A. Before starting the video, please subscribe our channel, like, share, comment, and must press the bell icon to watch more videos like this. And uh, you can also follow us on LinkedIn, Facebook, and Instagram. Before working uh, on this uh, main unit, you can see the condition of this uh, Fujika walkthrough gate main unit. You can see. Look this. Now I show you inside. Now you can see the internal condition of this walkthrough gate. This is the main board of this walkthrough metal detector gate, as you can see. Look. And this is the power supply of this uh, gate. Now, again I show you, look this, close view, so this is the condition of this walkthrough metal detector gate. Now the condition of this, uh, I tell you, the condition of this walkthrough gate is, this is dead, in the dead condition right now. we. Work on this and I show you how to repair and on this uh, walkthrough metal detector main unit. So I have uh, separate this uh, main board from the wooden box as you can see. Here you can see clearly the water damages as you can see. Look this if I can show you here you can see the clear the water damages so first of all we separate all these two data cables from the main board So separate these two data cables first. Now uh, clean this board uh, with the uh, help of brush and uh, motherboard cleaner. So this look this this dust can be removed first must remove this dust and the water damage first then as you can see clean this board like this Now separate this uh, card from the main unit. These are six cards. Look. And now clean this main board carefully and uh, remove all the dust and stains from here okay and you can see on this side look this as you can see 
the condition of this menu unit as you can see so now as you can see we have uh, cleaned all these uh, boards with uh, motherboard cleaner as you can see look the shine of this board now now first of all uh, we check this board and uh, we attach this board with the power supply at first this is the power supply and uh, at first we switch on this power supply from here now and uh, fix here 12 volts because this board need 12 volts to operate rotate this volume knob to set here the 12 volts as you can see now as you can see now we attach uh, these 12 volts power supply terminals to the main board look this now look this as you can see this is the power jack push this power jack here on the jack number J10 push this here and check is it working or not yes this main board this main board is on now as you can see look look this If you can see this board is working now look this but must check the all the parameters and voltages from here on the back sides now rotate the selector switch and fix it on 20 volts dc as you can see and attach this ground point here and first of all check at this point yes 11.88 volts here now press the power line here check this regulator first input is 11.89 and output is 5.12 so this is the 5 volt regulator as you can see yes this is 5 volt regulator and look this input is 11.90 and this is uh, using for the negative volts so this pin is ground and this is output of this regulator so this is negative volt from 7 volts minus 7 volts so check the next one this is input is 11.91 and output is 7 volts dc okay now check this one this is the input of this 11.90 and this is the output of this regulator so this is i think this is 12 volt regulator so because the input is low so output is not exactly 12 volts so this is working 
perfectly good so all the uh, regulators are working good now and now check the functions uh, from main control units okay let's see now I show you with the close look these are function buttons as you can see look this one two three four functions switches here this one is power on off switch press this switch to switch on this board now as you can see this board is on now as you can see so check all the functions and features with the help of these function switches this is setting button look this p4 password again push this switch this is h that's for main sensitivity level so uh, at first i off this lamp to show you uh, the display you can see easily right now now this is the main uh, sensitivity level okay we fix it on 20 now these two buttons and ups and down you can up and down from these two buttons again press this this is f f me f4 frequency this is set now on 50 you can also uh, change from up and down buttons as you can see look this now again push this switch this is l1 left side zone 1 this is set on 55 again press l2 left side zone 2 this is l3 left side zone 3 l4 left side zone 4 again press this switch this is l5 left zone 5 this is l6 left side zone 6 so this is 6 zone uh, work to get uh, main unit so this is d d1 this is d1 it's mean uh, if you change this d1 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 uh, you can change this from up and down switches you can select any from one to three only three levels so the function of this number of beep if you select one only beep once if you select two beep two times and if you select three from here the three beeps in one detection so next one uh, again set this on one and uh, push this switch again this is why why will mean volume three levels uh, again one two or uh, zero one two <clears throat> so zero is uh, mute and this is low level and this is high volume again uh, press this setting button this is y d as you can see So this is the uh, you can 
if I show you, wait a moment. So, look this. I have attached uh, the buzzer here with the board to show you. Uh, then will be easy for you to learn. This is the YD. YD mean uh, type of tones you can say as I show you. So here are, as you can see, there are 10 types of uh, tones, as you can see. Again press the uh, setting button, this is A, A mean uh, beep sound short or long. So again I think there are 3 levels, uh, yes, this is the beep sound short or long. So we set this on 1 again, press this switch, so this is the function button, now you can again press this power on of switch once, now again this main unit moves into normal mode. So this is the normal mode and as you can uh, you can see 00, zero shown on both displays. This one uh, as you can see uh, this is the pass counter. This counts uh, how many people pass from this walkthrough gate and this is the alarm counter. How many people carry uh, metal within so this uh, display shows how many people with metals pass from this uh, walk to get now this uh, board is ready and all the functions and features are working good so this is the video and uh, if you like our video please subscribe our channel like share comment and must press the bell icon to watch more videos like this and you can also follow us on uh, linkedin facebook and instagram keep watching till next allah hafiz